Hello, anybody. I am Alpaca Patrol, and this is Binding Advisor Grab the Lamb. Let's run back with another custom challenge run. This run is called Decisions, Decisions. Um, and essentially, uh, oh, it's by Invictus Chris, by the way. I should mention that, who has actually had three straight challenge runs in a row, by the way. But anyway, uh, basically, the rules are I have, uh, Sacred Heart, I have, we need to go deeper, also known as the shovel, and I have, uh, the sun card. And basically the rules are, I use the shovel until I get down to the Depths 2, or the Necropolis 2, whatever it, uh, it actually may be. Um, and then, uh, and then essentially I get to choose a new- oh, this is nice and easy. Um, then essentially I get to choose, uh, a spacebar item that I can use. Uh, and, uh, basically, all of these items were of my choosing. Now I, now I get to choose a, a spacebar item of my choosing. What I'm going to choose is, in fact, uh, the candle. If I could. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, God! Oh, dear! Our goal is indeed the, uh, the chest, actually. So, uh, balls. Bad room. Bad room. But luckily, we have the candle, so glorious days shall abound. Uh, I don't know where we got that blue heart from. Was it the- does Sacred Heart give you a blue heart? I think Sacred Heart gives you a blue heart. It's interesting. I actually didn't know that. Anyway, um, so let me just turn off, uh, a couple of things. I gotta turn off infinite item power, firstly. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. Cool. Okay, and now our goal is the chest, and hopefully we will be able to succeed in our goal. I don't know if that is going to indeed be the case. Um, but, uh, it's a possibility. Um, obviously now I'm allowed to take items and stuff. But also, obviously, I haven't gotten any items. Like, I've literally gotten none. Uh, so, uh, basically I have to try to succeed with the candle and, uh, and Sacred Heart. Which, admittedly, is a pretty damn good, uh, combination. Now that I- uh, by the way, I have three chances in order to succeed here. Um, so, uh, so if- if worse comes to worse, I could try again. Uh, and the second time, I might choose some different items. I actually realize now which item I should have chosen. Uh, but that's fine. It's not a big deal. Sacred Heart, you know, we haven't seen Sacred Heart in a long time. Because I was thinking, like, what items are so god- un- like, un- like, ridiculously rare that, uh, that- that warrant, uh, you know, using? I figured Sacred Heart is pretty fucking rare. Uh, and indeed it is! It is pretty much impossible to find. In fact, we're actually gonna go, uh, look for the item room. Uh, you know what? Why not? Right? I mean, we got two keys, but, uh, never mind. <laughs> Fuck myself in the beehole. Please work this time. Ugh, oh, god, I hate when the game does that to you. Oh, good, chestception, and we got a key out of it. Alright, well, so we lost two, <laughs> two bombs. For, uh, two things. You know what? Uh, yeah, no, I'll go, I'll go find this, the item room. Maybe we'll get something great. Maybe we'll get, like, an amazing item. Um, even a speed up would be pretty good. A tears up, in general, would be pretty good. The problem is that I don't actually want to go explore it into rooms and then, yeah, see, take damage, which is exactly what, yeah, take lots of damage. That's even better. Um, this is a terrible room for our current set of items. Um, so, uh, yeah, this is, this is exactly why I didn't want to explore. But, you know what? Man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. We gotta go to find the treasure room. See what we could get. I mean, we got, like, one op one chance to find something. Oh, God. This room is gonna be fucking impossible. Ah, oh, damn. Ah, oh, I hate everything. Oh, God. This is real bad. Things are getting dire here. We got low health, but we have the sun. I mean, worst comes to worst. Although, obviously, I wouldn't like to use it on, you know, a necropolis floor. I'd much prefer to use it on, say, a boss or something. Uh, okay, good. We got the treasure room. Now we can go fight Mom. We got homing bombs. Ah, uh, you know, that's okay. That's, that's alright. I, I can, I can live with homing bombs. That's not, a that's not a big deal. Um, we actually, oh no, we need two keys to open that. So we definitely don't want to do that. We need a bomb and two keys. You know... Isaac should really have a thing where the golden chests, or like a better reward, because honestly a bomb and two keys, 
is probably not worth a golden chest, even if it gives you, like, the best thing, and the best thing would be probably, like, fate. I mean, then it's definitely worth it, but that is so freaking rare that, uh, it's, it's not possible. Anyway, let's go find Mom, who we are going to be able to cheese with the candle, which is nice. However, I, uh, I'm also going to use the candle like a big dumb idiot. Uh, unless I do that, oh, and then I take a full heart of damage, that's a bummer. But it's cool, it's cool. We're doing lots of damage through way of the, uh, Sacred Heart. Alright, we got a Tears Up, and we got a card. The High Priestess is a good card, but, uh, I think I'm gonna keep the Sun, and then, uh, we take the Polaroid, move on to the next floor. You know what I'd really like is Cancer. I mean, not in real life, obviously, um, but Cancer would be fucking great as a trinket. However, we don't have anything that'll, uh, really give us that. The Joker! You know what? Let's use it. Okay, we got the Pact for two. Um, do we really need the damage? I mean, not really. It gives us, like, an all stats up. Fuck it, let's do it. We got two chances, right? That's what I'm thinking, anyway. Uh, we have the Sun card, which isn't gonna do much for us anymore. Uh, besides be a glorified world card. Uh, but hopefully we get, like, a health up or something out of this next room. Or out of this next boss, rather. Wow, that actually, that actually, like, totally tanked the frame rate in my game. That's kind of funny. And also kind of sad, I mean, it kind of goes to show how, because this computer is a monster, by the way. Uh, a monster that has started making noise again, also, is another thing that I should mention. Uh, but, uh, yeah, no, this computer is a fucking monster, so, for this game to, to chug on it. Like, I run Crisis 3 at, like, 60 frames per second, pretty much. Um, so, you know. Uh, it's, uh, it's kind of sad that The Binding of Isaac has trouble running, uh, running particle effects on explosions. But I guess that's the limitations of Flash, which is why everybody's moving over to HTML5, in the future anyway, I suppose not, not necessarily yet. Although, you know, a lot of people are doing it, like, uh, Google is already, uh, yep, yeah, but hey, look at this fucking guy. Thinks he's a hot shit! Alright, we're still good. Alright, cool. And we can fight whoever this boss is. And it is double Loki. I don't like fighting double Loki, I'll be honest. He's a tough, he's a tough, uh, tough opponent. Not when you have, uh, the candle and sacred heart, though. Um, well, I guess we'll take this range up. It's, it's not really gonna help us, obviously, but, um, yeah, and there's nothing else I really wanna do there. And I guess we'll, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna blow up these rocks and hope for a blue heart. Nope, no such luck. Alright, whatever. Off to the next floor we go, then. Um, hmm. Okay, we actually have the womb too, which luckily isn't utero too, which means we don't have to deal with Gertie at the very least. You know, the pact plus all that that other thing, the uh, the magic eight ball, is making our shots fired uh, go uh, really really fast. Shots fired hashtag. Um, but uh, yeah, the fucking yeah. By, that by the way, I don't follow the rules of hashtags. I put them at the end of the sentences. I put them at the beginning of the sentences. Oh come on, a single candle shot didn't kill him. That's ridiculous. That's a load of ridiculousness. Anyway, we have the secret room, which, I don't know, could be something good. Eh, I'll blow it up. We could play it for four cents, which, yeah, is maybe not a bad idea, but, uh, you know, it's also probably not a good idea. Anyway, uh, oh, that's interesting. I hope that's not the right way. Up, up, oh, farts. Alright, well, that sucks. That really sucks. I always get confused in this room when I first start, because I'm always just like, hey, blast away, and then it's like, nope, don't do that. Oh dear. Um, so things, we're now in dire straits. A single hit puts us in dire straits, which, uh, you know, I, I, I already knew that was gonna happen. Not that we were gonna get hit, but I, that, that a single, a single shot was gonna put us in dire straits. Indeed, that was the case. I really want, please be balls of steel. Bombs are key. Well, I mean, alright. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's not great, obviously, but uh, it's not it's not the worst thing in the world, I suppose. Okay, luckily the candle doing good work. We can also use the candle to uh, to grief mom's heart, but uh, it's actually not as effective. Like it, you can do it, but it's I don't know. I just don't find it as effective as uh, doing it to to mom. 
Just because also, like, this fight isn't that hard, um, is the other thing. Like, normally I can, I can defeat this fight without taking any damage. Now, because I've said that, that means that I'm, that, that is not gonna be the case. Generally speaking, the times that I take damage are through RNG, uh, from her bombs, like, just going in a weird way. Alright, we succeeded. Now we gotta go fight Isaac with two hearts. And the sun, admittedly, but, uh, yeah, one heart, never mind, is what it looks like. No, we're dead. Alright, well, there goes try number one. Uh, I guess I'll be back in a moment. Let's try number two. Alright, we're back! Try number two! Uh, Alright, the audio recording got all screwed up, so it's gonna be a weird cut. Sorry about that. Anyway, uh, we are, uh, gonna be, uh, back. Uh, and, and doing some more action. Uh, in the old Binding uh, Day Isaac. This is why I don't like doing the complicated runs, because usually technical issues abound. But uh, anyway, we are going to go ahead and... Uh, oh, we have to we have to select... Now we have to select um, uh, our spacebar item, which I actually haven't thought about what exactly I want to do. Um, let's think about this. What do I want? I kind of want one of the ponies. That might be good. Um... Necronomicon, no. The nail, maybe. I was thinking about it. Um, D20, D6, I don't need any of that. Uh, the belt, the Bible. Flap for the dummies. Uh, I don't really need anything of that. Tammy's head, super bandage. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should get something that would be good against, uh, good against Isaac. I don't know what would be, necessarily. Yeah, you know what, I think I'm just gonna go for the white pony. Because I, I, I can't really think of anything else off the top of my head that I really want. Or, the pinking shears is a possibility. Nah, yeah, whatever. We'll just go for the white pony. Man, I haven't used Epic Fetus in a long time. It's been quite some time, I have to say. Uh, alright. Actually, firstly, I need to turn off some things in, uh, in the game. In the cheat engine. Uh, okie dokie. Fantastic. We are back. We're headed off towards, uh, our foe. Which is Mom. And Mom should- whoa. Alright, we found the super secret room. That's actually kinda nice. I- was not expecting to do that. I probably should be looking for it with Epic Fetus. Alright, what do we got? Ah, Troll Bomb. Let's get out of there then. <laughs> definitely don't want to deal with the Troll Bomb. It's definitely not what I would consider something that I- Wow, super- the regular secret room and the super secret room. Room after room! Alright, we're gonna have to gonna blow that up. Cause we don't need it. Oh, I almost- I almost caught it! Did you see that? Did you just see that?! My god, I almost caught it! Anyway, uh, well... Uh, that's the wrong way. This is, however, hopefully the right way. But yeah, we have again taken the sun, which I'm again okay with. I think the sun is a good card. So I, I think uh, I think that's fine. But I think clearly Epic Fetus is probably our best bet at victory. Our best chance at survival. I mean, I feel like... I feel like that's the item that... Uh, that really kind of assures a victory, no matter what. Um, now, I, I suppose we're going to find out whether... Whoa, okay, he didn't die. Okay, see, sometimes they die, sometimes they don't die. I don't know what the deal is with that. Anyway, we'll take this key. We are actually going to go uh, explore and try to find the treasure room. Ah, uh, yeah, actually, you know what? I will take the skeleton key. I know that it means that I'm going to have to fight uh, this room, which kind of sucks, but... Uh... Oh, we took damage. That's a bummer. Man, I gotta get used to using Epic Fetus again, uh, because I haven't used it in uh, quite some time. Because of how freaking rare it is. Like, seriously rare. And I know people, by the way, before you make the comment, like, like, oh, you could use the mouse to use Epic Fetus, I really don't actually like you doing that at all. I, I really don't like aiming with the mouse. I actually much prefer 
uh, aiming with uh, with the keyboard. I, I tend to shoot myself a lot with the mouse. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take damage. That's fine, not a big deal, because we do have a uh, a red heart lying around. Okay, we got something. Bad gas. All right, all right, all right. That's fine. We'll go in here. We got the uh, Celtic Cross, which is actually awesome. That's that's actually a great thing uh, to get. Definitely. Uh, let's go in here, see what we got. Ah, uh, we got the point hoist for, uh, for that amount of money. That's not a good amount of money. I mean, that's not good for me, honestly. I don't think, I don't think I want that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take a heart. Take a blue heart as well, uh, from the shop. And then go fight this boss, which, I don't know, man. I don't know. We should be able to succeed pretty easily. Oh, but it is red mob. Which is not actually what you want to face. Oh, I, I screwed it up. Oh, no, I didn't screw it up. Okay. Oh, balls. Oh, uh, dicks. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm getting confused here. Hold on a second. Okay. And that's a victory. All right, well, we've, we succeeded finally. Despite screwing up pretty hard there. Kelty Cross, by the way, is going to go a long way, I have to say. Uh, because I love hay. I am an alpaca. I'm a grazing animal. You know, we're fans of hay. All grazing animals are fans of hay. Actually, here's a question. Do animals... Do animals eat hay? Because I don't actually know. I'm not honestly sure uh, whether or not animals eat hay. Uh, it's possible that they do. I, I'm, I would not be the man to ask, however... I mean, obviously, maybe I should be, considering I am an al- MOTHERFUCKER! This fucking guy. I killed him, and then he showed up under me. This game sometimes, man. This game sometimes. It really is a bag of D's. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? I- I can't kill this guy. He's unkillable. Can I actually just not kill him with this? Alright, well, I guess I can't kill him. That's interesting. I, I don't know what- I don't think I've ever encountered that problem with Epic Fetus. I'm pretty sure he's died every time I use Epic Fetus. I don't know what's going on, but he cannot- he would not die. Oh boy. Okay, this is bad. This is a bad room. Okay. Luckily, we succeeded. And it gave us a heart, too, which is which is also nice. Remember, we do... Fuck. God damn it. I was gonna say we do have invincibility. You know what? I'll take this instead of the uh, full heart. And I will definitely open that. Alright, fine. I'll take, uh, I'll take another half a heart. Um, so, let's see if I can kill him. Alright, well, I killed him then. I don't know what's going on, man. We got Puberty. Not a very good card. Ah. Well, luckily we have hearts lying around on the floor. Fucking spiders, man. Give me spiders and Gertie Jr. It's a messed up floor. We also have Utero 1, keep in mind, I suppose. So, uh, unfortunately... This is going to be a little bit tougher than last time. Oh god, especially when we're going to take so much damage. But we have succeeded again in this room, and we have a full heart over here as well. You know what I should be doing is I should be blowing up every single rock that I see, because honestly... Oops, a daisy. I will definitely use that. The tick! Well, can't take that. Yeah, I'm going to blow up every single rock that I see, because they could be blue rocks. And blue rocks could be... Uh, good rocks. Man, this is a messed up room. Ugh. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, well, um, we don't have full health, which is kind of a bummer. Um, but that is because we have gotten... Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Alright, well, we gotta use the sun. So that sucks. Wow. Alright, well, that was a shitty, shitty room. Uh, we will take the spoon. 
And move on to the next floor. Things aren't looking so good for us right now. I'm gonna be honest. We have, uh... We... Oh, okay, I thought that was Double Gertie Jr. again, and I was about to be very angry at the game being douchebag... douchebag tastical to me. Luckily, it wasn't. And luckily we have the womb, too, not, uh, not utero, too, because if it was utero, too, shit would be bad. This fucking guy and his spiders. Okay, cool. We have the Hermit, which is a useless card, but hey, you know, uh, it's fine. It's not a big deal. Luckily you don't have to land these straight on, because if you did, then I would be, uh, failing. Yeah, we took kill two birds with one stone. Which is always nice. It's always nice killing two birds with one stone, because then you get a bunch of fucking bird meat to eat. What is the deal with, like, here's a question. Why don't... I actually don't remember what my question was, so never mind. Never mind, that uh, is an unnecessary question. Um... Mm. Okay, success. We have lots of hearts dropping on the floor, which is great. That is a great, great thing. Okay, he's dead. We went the wrong way, unfortunately. But, uh, hopefully, we'll find something that resembles a boss. And by resembles a boss, I mean is a boss. Because that would be great. Um, an arcade would also be kind of good. I mean... It wouldn't be that good, but it'd be pretty good. Alright, no blue rocks, unfortunately. Looks like we're just gonna have to go fight this boss, wherever it may be. It is, right, yeah, it is definitely going to be, um, oh, I'm a big fucking idiot. Whatever. Alright. We are doing some successful things, namely defeating Mom's heart very expediently, because Epic Fetus is amazing, and easily one of the best items in the game. Shit, alright, we're almost dead. Almost dead. But we got a blue heart, and we got lots of hearts lying around, so we don't really have to worry about that. Um, so we will definitely go ahead and take that like a so. Because we definitely want half a heart just so that we could get the uh, Polaroid effect to kick in at least. And maybe that will mean our inevitable success. Um, oh god. Did it drop a bomb? No, alright. Okay, I have to be very careful. Very careful with the red fires. Okay, anyway. Um... I'm gonna take damage, which is great. Oh no! Damn, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I'll get a troll bomb. Okay, firstly, get out of my way. Secondly, ah, damn. I'm just gonna get out of here, because this is the wrong way. Uh, and then we shall hopefully find the boss this way? Oh, Double Gertie Jr. Not what I like to see. Alright, but hey, it gave us a blue heart. That's pretty good. I'm okay with that. Ah, fuck. Alright, well, we lost our blue heart, but hey, we still have full health. So there's always something to look forward to. Or look on the bright side of. Or, uh, you know, other things of the sort. Hey, we got the boss, which is Isaac. Whoa, what the hell just happened there? That was something glitch -tastical. Okay, so, uh, what we are actually gonna do, and this may seem silly, we're gonna go ahead and hurt ourselves with a bomb, and then we're gonna take this half a heart, and then we're gonna fight, uh, Isaac. Because, what I'm thinking here, is that, uh, we want the Polaroid to kick in at some point, now what I'm gonna... shit. I'm gonna shit! Uh dear. Uh, okay. As long as the game doesn't fuck me super hard.
Okay, I had to deal with the angels. Okay, okay. We defeated Isaac. That is fantastic. We will actually go and get that heart, because there's a red heart line around. Um, so that's good. Oh, uh, well, that's close enough, I suppose. That's as close as we're going to get, at the very least. And then uh, we'll go up to the chest, or go down to the chest. Go into the chest, really, more than anything else. Okay, piercing shots. Odd Mushroom, very good, is going to give us a health up. I'll take the piercing shots. I don't think it really does anything for us, but uh, I'll take it. Um, so I'm, I'm cool with that. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, that didn't hurt him. I don't know what the deal is with these uh, invincible enemies that are that keep happening. Alright. There's a weird thing that's occurring here. Where these enemies keep getting invincible. Please be something good. Bad trip. Fuck. You know, I kind of knew that that was going to be a bad trip pill, and uh, I was afraid of it being a bad trip pill. Okay, please give me a heart. Something. Okay, this could be my death. No! Oh no! I killed myself! Oh, I can't believe I killed myself. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks so hard. But you know what? Honestly, I think, considering uh, we just use the most powerful item in the game, I don't think we're going to be able to succeed here in this challenge run. I think uh, I think this is going to be the end for us. We got pretty far, though. Um, we almost beat the chest. But, uh, but I killed myself in the end, because I'm a big dumb idiot. And that's what I do. I be, I be idiotin son. So, uh, but Epic Fetus, I think, is the way that you would do it, obviously. Um, it would require just me not taking as much damage as I did. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's gonna be the end of this run for right now. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Post your custom challenge runs down below. I did the most upvoted one. This was indeed the most upvoted one. By the way, people were asking, well, people were saying, multiple people were actually saying, like, oh, that run was too overpowered yesterday. Uh, you should really do more challenging runs and stuff. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I, I, I literally have no like, I, I, I have no control over that. You guys have the control. You guys, if you think that the run is overpowered, then upvote a different run. Because, uh, honestly, I, I, like I said, I do the most upvoted challenge run. I don't do anything else. I have, I have no control over it. I just do what is most upvoted. Unless, of course, it's, like, literally undoable. Um, so, uh, so yeah. So, if you, if you want to, you know... Uh, if you want to see something that isn't particularly overpowered, like perhaps this run, then upvote something that isn't particularly overpowered. But really, it's in your hands. You have the vote, you have the power, it's the power of the people. Uh, it's majority rule. It's the tyranny of the majority. Um, but yeah, basically, that's what you gotta do. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed, thanks for watching. Uh, post your custom challenge runs down below, I'll do the most upvoted one. Whether that be OP or unfair. I will do it. Anyway, this is Alpaca Patrol signing out. Peace, fools.